Imagine being at the scene of the most intense boxing rivalry ever Rolando Roley Romero and Shakur Stevenson, two titans of the ring, are at odds with one another. Their animosity has reached a pyrotechnic level, not just a smoldering quarrel. We're about to embark on the most recent chapter of their epic feud, and I promise you won't want to miss a second of it. With just one tweet, it all began. As always, Roley Romero chose to inflame the situation by making fun of Shakur Stevenson. He was crying in Rio, you didn't make it to the trial, Roley scoffed. Shakur, who was never one to back down from a challenge, answered right away, and before anyone knew what was going on, their rivalry had a rivalry had erupted into a heated live session. Is the intensity already beginning to build? These two have a very long past together. For many years, Shakur Stevenson and Roley Romero have been bitter rivals, both inside and outside of the ring. Shakur recently concluded his contract with Top Rank and has been enjoying the pleasures of free agency. Shakur alleged, Top Rank attempted to undermine me I turned down their deal because I knew my value. In the meantime, Roley's provocative remarks and heated altercations have been in the news. Though Roley's most recent fight against Ismail Barroso ended in a dubious stoppage, he hasn't lost faith in himself. Have you ever seen someone exude such confidence following an uncertain victory? Roley couldn't help but poke fun at Shakur after his most recent victory. Regarding Shakur's Olympic trials, he tweeted, You didn't even make it to trial this now deleted tweet served as the spark that ignited the fire. Shakur fired back on social media, sparking a heated live session in which the two spat insults. A fighter who ducked me couldn't be defeated exclaimed Shakur. Your career is done you should be an influencer boxer already. Relentlessly assertive, Raleigh shot back who you knock out. In boxing history you are the most uninteresting fighter ever. Despite their best efforts no one is interested in signing you. This feud was about more than just words as the insults started flying. With distinct ideologies and objectives, the two boxers have been navigating their careers. Shakur, a previous silver medalist in the Olympics, takes great satisfaction in his tactical abilities. On the flip side, Roley is renowned for his forceful style and ability to knock opponents out. Shakur had been thoughtfully pondering his next move amidst the commotion. His recent victory over Artem Harutunian signaled the end of his top-ranked contract, and he is currently considering his free agency options. I believe my worth surpasses what they provided, Shakur clarified. I'm talking to everyone to see what's the best available option. Oscar de la Hoya, who has expressed a strong desire to sign Shakur, is among the more fascinating options. William Zapita, the boxer representing de la Hoya, is a dangerous challenger who just recorded his 31st victory via 27 knockouts. Oscar has been keen on getting his fighter a title shot, and Shakur is potentially in the running, de la Hoya stated. William made a statement, now we go for the world title. In response to this event, Shakur tweeted something insightful Oscar just added himself to the mix too. It's been a fascinating few weeks. Large fights using all methods required. Shakur is thrilled about the chance to work with Matchroom, and Eddie Hearn has some big fight deals for him as well. Eddie Hearn is one of the best promoters in the game, stated Shakur. I'm definitely going to talk to everybody else, but he's one of the best in the game. Shakur must deal with an old foe first though, before he can decide on his destiny. Shakur has consistently faced criticism for his fighting technique from Roley Romero, who frequently calls him out as a dull boxer. Where was you at in the past in one of Roley's interviews, he scoffed. Shakur doesn't have the knockout power, and his fights are a snooze fest. But is style the only thing that matters or is there more to it? Is Roley concerned that Shakur is more technically adept than he is? Despite Roley's abrasive remarks, Shakur is a top contender in the sport because of his skills, which have won him respect and recognition. The boxing world is a hive of speculation as this feud intensifies. Shakur might decide to fight Roley to finally settle the score. If that's the case, who will win? Fans are excited to see how this drama plays out because both boxers have a lot on the line. Shakur has been receiving offers from several promoters who are all trying to sign him, which heightens the mystery. Two interesting offers are being made by Oscar De La Hoya's Golden Boy Promotions and Eddie Hearn's Matchroom Boxing. De La Hoya has suggested a possible matchup with William Zapata, and Hearn has outlined a three-fight schedule that involves boxing Liam Paro at 140 pounds before a huge co-promotion with PBC for a super fight between Stevenson and Tank Davis. Roley keeps disparaging Shakur in the middle of all of this. He went into a rant, ridiculing Shakur's status as a free agent during a recent live session. Roley shouted, 
No one wants to sign you. You're boring and you can't sell a fight. You're a bum Roly shot back Shakur, who was obviously furious. A combatant who ducked me couldn't be defeated by you. Your professional days are over. You ought to already be a boxer with influence. It became clear that this wasn't only about boxing as the heated discussion went on. It was a private matter. Shakur's character and accomplishments were also targeted by Roly's criticisms, in addition to his fighting style. Moreover, Shakur didn't hold back either, criticizing Roly's defeats and casting doubt on his fighting prowess. However, there's more going on here than just bluster and trash talk. Shakur's boxing career hasn't been without hardships. Shakur has had to struggle for everything he has accomplished, from his early years in Newark, New Jersey, to becoming a world champion and an Olympic silver medalist. He is regarded as one of the most renowned fighters in the sport because of his technical prowess, self-control, and tactical approach. Broly, though, has chosen an alternative route. He has established a reputation as a fighter who can finish a bout with a single blow thanks to his aggressive fighting style and knockout power. However, there are now doubts regarding his eligibility as a leading candidate following his contentious victory over Ismail Barroso. So what are these two fighters' next moves? Will they compete against one another to resolve their differences? What kind of fight might we anticipate if they do? Rolly's natural strength along with Shakur's technical skill would make for an entertaining and unpredictable fight. Shakur is considering his choices in the meanwhile. He has the chance to mold his career and legacy with offers from leading promoters on the table. Shakur declared, I'm going to talk to everyone. I want to find the best option that I can possibly choose. Nonetheless, Eddie Hearn is among the greatest in the game, in my opinion. His enthusiasm and fighter promotion style are unparalleled. For his part, Roly is searching for his next big payoff. In an attempt to arrange a well-publicized bout, he challenged Ryan Garcia after his contentious victory. Roly tweeted, let's do this on Showtime pay-per-view, Ryan. It's time to give the fans what they want. However, Roly has his eye on other fighters besides Ryan Garcia. In addition, he wants a rematch with the opponent who gave him his first professional defeat, Gervonta Tank Davis. Tank was my biggest payday, and I'm ready for round two, Roly commented. Let's make it happen. The boxing world is anxious to see what will happen next since there are a lot of moving pieces and significant stakes. When will Shakur and Roly square up in the ring? If that's the case, who will win? There's only one thing for sure this feud is far from ended. Let's remember the importance of the fans in all of this as we come to a close. Since boxing is a passionate sport, the support and excitement of the spectators are essential to its growth. Your voice counts, regardless of whether you're Team Roly or Team Shakur. When these two ultimately square off, who do you think will prevail? What are your thoughts on their continuing conflict? The drama is just getting started, so keep an eye out. The tale of Shakur Stevenson and Roly Romero is a memorable one, filled with heated arguments, dangerous haggling, and lots of profanity. Keep your gloves on and prepare for the next round till we meet again. Ever pondered the inner workings of a fighter? Is it something more, or is it just their talent or confidence? It appears to be a combination of all three in the cases of Shakur Stevenson and Roly Romero. The compelling nature of their competition stems from the distinct styles and personalities of each combatant. Shakur's technical skill and calculated approach are well-renowned. He is an expert at outboxing opponents and forcing errors from them. Hard effort and determination have been essential components of his ascent to the top. Shakur has had to struggle for everything he has accomplished, from his early years in Newark, New Jersey, to becoming a world champion and an Olympic silver medalist. However, Roly is an incredible artist. His reputation as a fighter who can finish a fight with a single blow has grown imagined being at the scene of the most intense boxing rivalry ever Rolando Roly Romero and Shakur Stevenson, two titans of the ring, are at odds with one another. Their animosity has reached a pyrotechnic level, not just a smoldering quarrel. We're about to embark on the most recent chapter of their epic feud, and I promise you won't want to miss a second of it. With just one tweet, it all began. As always, Roly Romero chose to inflame the situation by making fun of Shakur Stevenson. You was crying in Rio, you didn't make it to the trial, Roly scoffed. Shakur, who was never one to back down from a challenge, answered right away, and before anyone knew what was going on, their rivalry had erupted into a heated live session. Is the intensity already beginning to build? These two have a very long past together. For many years, Shakur Stevenson and Roly Romero have been bitter rivals, both inside and outside of the ring. 
Shakur recently concluded his contract with top rank and has been enjoying the pleasures of free agency. Shakur alleged, Top rank attempted to undermine me I turned down their deal because I knew my value.